U.S. stocks, they're trading mixed Wednesday afternoon here on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. This in an attempt to recover from yesterday's massive sell-off as investors continue to watch the U.S. dollar for gains as well as indications of future Fed interest rate hikes. Meanwhile, in the Forex market, the U.S. dollar continuing to remain bullish against its counterparts. We first take a look at the Euro-U.S. dollar pair right now, 0.93% lower at a rate of 1.0582. We also have the British pound to U.S. dollar market, three quarters of a percent lower this afternoon at 149.43. This while the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair, that's 0.28 percent higher at a read of 121.47 yen. Meanwhile, trading central analysts, they continue to remain focused on the U.S. dollar Canadian dollar pair, which has hit a first target at 127.10 and also remains on the upside above 126.35. As long as 126.35 holds as a support, look for a further rise to 127.75 and 128.45. In extension. Moving on to precious metals, they continue to remain under pressure. We first take a look at gold prices, which are in focus as the downside prevails for gold. The daily indicator for gold, that's bearish and calling for further downside. So as long as the total of 1165 is not broken, expect a further downside towards 1147 as well as 1139 in extension. And moving on, we have silver prices 1.76% lower at a rate of 1535 a troy ounce. And don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter at the handle TCWebTV for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV, from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange, I'm James Swinney.